The government is seeking to tap into pensions and idle land in order to finance cheaper mortgages for Kenyans looking to own homes at cheaper rates. Well, this comes against the backdrop of increasing interest in mortgages, which, according to the Central Bank of Kenya, is a drop in the ocean. While speaking to journalists, both the Cabinet Secretary for Treasury, uh, Henry Rotich, and Cabinet Secretary for Transport, Infrastructure, Housing, and Urban Development, James Masharia, agreed there that there was a need for more to be done in order to improve access to mortgages. Land, technology, um, and even the supporting infrastructure, you go to slice the, the cost by more than 50%. Then you can talk about uh, houses of about a million shillings, which then a lot of Kenyans you get into the bracket. Uh, and then if we get an uh, affordable mortgage, which is what we shall be discussing with the uh, Treasury, then the whole thing becomes possible. All of you, you look very young. You can take mortgages of 25 years, and therefore the repayment will be affordable. And that's the target of, uh, of government. Cost uh, of, uh, of mortgages. Well, uh, we are still working on, on that. Um, we are looking at the challenge now, uh, as you know, if you go to a bank to borrow, even the, the maximum rate is about 14% at the moment. Uh, we are trying to, um, as I say, we are trying to mobilize uh, resources from the pension, uh, from the uh, insurance, uh, and, and provide sort of incentives, so to speak. Uh, once we have affordable houses, as the CS has mentioned, you say it's a million shillings, you can actually borrow also at a very cheap tech mortgage at a reasonable rate and be able to finance that uh, comfortably.